it's not about fear. So remember how I said these short horror films aren't really scary? Well, I was wrong. I was very shocked when I started watching this one. If I could give this film a grade, it would be A+. I mean it. This was good. Dare I say great? Okay, so it starts out with this guy walking into his home with something in the background just watching him. After he enters his home, it cuts to another character. We see a woman getting ready for what seems to be a date, and she is just excited, right? Absolutely over the moon. When she arrives at her date's house, it's the man we saw earlier. So they are conversating, you know, flirting, having a good time. But in the background, there's this thing right? It's still there. It's taking all the willpower of this man to ignore it, but it's obviously there intentionally. I really don't want to tell you any more about this short film because you have to watch it. It gets deep. It hits you on a whole nother level, right? Okay, so out of the handful of short films I've seen so far, this one is the best. Like I said, it's very deep. Every single scene has something to do with the narrative and you probably won't understand it until the end. Pay attention to all the little details and what's being said by the characters because it is top notch. If I were to describe this film in one word, that word would be gasping. Shout out to the creator Clement Johim and Alter for making this film. Thank you guys for watching and I will talk to you next time. Bye.